In the spotlight tonight, a staple on Cleveland's east side is closing its doors for good. Corky and Lenny has been serving up matzo ball soup and Rubens and Woodmere for nearly 70 years. Our Danielle Wiggins has more. Grown men brought to tears. I've cried a couple times already, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to be strong. As employees and customers process the news of the closure of Corky and Lenny's restaurant and deli. Unfortunately, we just don't have the help that we used to have, and uh, it's, it's too much now. Adam Siegel is a manager at Corky and Lenny's who says he's been with the company for 26 years. The restaurant was short-staffed about 15 to 20 people, according to Siegel. After we reopened after the pandemic, we had many, many employees that never came back. And running a large restaurant, short staff, just became too much for owner Kenny Curland. I think that Kenny, my husband, just hit a breaking point. At 4 a.m., he woke me up and said, this is it, this is the day. Curland's wife, Amanda, says she didn't believe he was serious about closing the restaurant until Curland called the employees here early this morning, telling them to put a sign on the door letting customers know Corky and Lenny's is done. We are family and uh, a lot of laughs together. Um, so many regular customers that come in and know us by name and we know them by name. And it's uh, kind of speechless. The iconic spot known for their matzo ball soup, corned beef and deli trays first opened in 1956 in Cedar Center and the current location opened in 1973. Siegel says He's numb right now at the news of the closing. It's going to take a while to absorb what just happened. In the village of Woodmere, Danielle Wiggins, 3 News. Now, Kenny Curland is the son of Corky Curland, one of the original owners of Corky and Lenny's. Curland's wife, Amanda, tells 3 News, employees will be paid through the end of the year. That's really important. She says if the restaurant and deli reopens in the future, fingers crossed, it will be a much smaller operation.